Touch. What's up, y'all? It's Screw the Rules Yugi here, and I got my boy. Anthony, good, bro, and he's finally getting a shot in the <laughs> channel because you're Some literally undefeated girl. first place. Like, what are you doing? Caca. We got the Tri Brigade Lyralusk, the classic. Bro, you're on the birds. Oh! How long have you been playing the deck for? Because you've been playing this deck for a while. Um, I've been playing, I don't remember when Phantom Rage came out, but like when I saw the deck profile on MBT's channel, I was like, that looks fun and cheap. <laughs> Anthony, do you remember your matchups for today? Um, for today, it was first round, um, Despia. Second round was against Despia. Third round was against, uh, you, Brian. Yeah. <laughs> My village. And shout out to Red Reboot in that matchup. <laughs> Bro, he just said drew the one up on me, and, but he had two Cosmic Cyclones, so it didn't matter. His hand was cracked. Yeah. I one, was losing no matter one what. One for one pitch <laughs> Nerval, it was a great, great little combo that I had going on. No! All right, Anthony, let's get into this deck profile, bro. Let's get into this first place undefeated birds cacao deck profile. So start off with triple warbler, double sparrow, and two co two cobalt. These are just the um, the original birds. Also, double barrel mm -hmm. and double wagtail. Two, okay. two, 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 and then three of the best one. I got reasons for this ratio. Basically, um, any two birds is full combo. Jesus Christ, yes. <laughs> uh, any, any two birds is really full combo. I've, there's been many matches where I've just normal summoned DD Crow and then done this effect, special summon two birds, and then it, it works. And you just combo, bro. You just go off. It just works. Of course! After the uh, bird package, uh, we basically bridge into the try package with triple triple Nerval because mm -hmm. any uh, bird searcher can really get uh, into the try package. Search Nerval, yep. triple Fractal, one Karis, one Kit. One Karis and one Kit? Ooh, okay. Yeah. Uh, just because Kit's really corner case. Um, if you need extra bodies in the grave, it's really good to send. But also, um, the best card to search off of Nerval is Kit because of follow-up. Um, if you leave this on board, you get impermed. Uh, next turn, you've got Kit for the search. Gotcha. Um, and you've got basically your resource train keeps going. Okay. Um, Karis is also just a uh, really good extender in that aspect. And then of course Revolt, which uh, for the tri package it's just like one Revolt. It's just Soul Charge on crack, to be honest. You're goddamn right. So that's it for the tri package, including the trap. Gotcha. And then moving on to the spell package, uh, we've got a broken one of. Um, the broken one. -ups. Broken one. -ups. If I see it, I win. <laughs> yeah, if, if I see it, it's just like bait, 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 and then full combo. Yeah. <laughs> um, or if it goes through, it's like, damn, I guess I'm going full, full combo today. Like that's what's mm -hmm. happening. The reason I play two birds is because banishing a one of bird would really suck. Um, and it really makes gives this deck this card like a lot of value. Um, and I barely banish what I need off. Banish two birds off of it because all you need is one bird in rotation you can always get it back from banish with um bear brum or the revolt um to like put it back into the graveyard special summon for later it, it works gotcha. really well gotcha um and then for the lear lusk of course triple bird call which yes. is just insane plays around droll because you can foolish and then special from hand gets you a free body um it's just it's an amazing card like it gave everything the lear lusk package needed like it gave it gas mm -hmm. and then the spice you got two jack in the hand Who? what is this you're the only tri layers player I know that's playing that. So, oh I mean, it, it made me go undefeated at, reg at the um, Wisconsin Regional Woo! for up to, up to the sixth round. And, oh, then I okay. and then I played And then I played Adrian, and he sort of whipped my ass. <laughs> shout, out, shout out to Midwest Gaming. Bro, um, proud of you, though. Proud yeah. of you. Can I see that? What, what yeah, is this? I don't think a lot of people have seen this card. Yeah. Yeah, wait, what does this do, actually? So, you show any level one monsters in your deck to your opponent. Um, you could show them Droll, DD Crow, whatever you want, but typically three bird names. Um, and then you get, they get one to their hand, you get one to your hand, and then the other goes back into the deck. Basically, this plus any bird name, um, adding all of these, you get to the other bird name regardless, so it's just giving your opponent the illusion of choice at that point, that they're gonna actually change your combo by giving you what card. Yeah. Whoa! So that's it for the, uh, the bird package and the spell lineup. Two jack in the hand, triple bird call. Got it. And then time for board breakers slash hand traps, triple droplet. Uh, Ooh. I, I do not own droplet. Uh, this oh. is property of my friend Chris. Shout out to him. Hey, shouts to Chris, bro. Yeah. Thank Chris you. Chris and Galaxy <laughs> Comics, uh, one of the uh, locals with a lot of really good people in it. Hey, let's go. Uh, I gotta got, go there one day. We got Imperm, uh, double dro double crow, double uh, ogre, double bell, mm -hmm. and then Ooh, really heavy, double ash. Heavy hand traps. Oh yeah. So thirteen no. uh, going second cards. Um, this is also. Uh, combo piece, quote-unquote. Because you can search this, right, in your deck? Yeah, search it, normal summon it, 
or it's not once per turn. That's what I really like about it. These two not once per turn. Only six once per turn. It's like better ratios for like not um, drawing into things that like oh, break gotcha. you. Oh, gotcha. You're right. You're um, right. Banishing off of desires too, leaving at least like one in deck. Um, and Crow just kills Despia for the branded and red combo a lot. Yeah, when they say yeah. target and you're like, all right, cool, DD Crow. And yeah, it resolves exactly. without effect. <laughs> and then also, Bell sort of sucks against, um, against uh, newer variants of Despia. And Crow is just better because Bell negates activation, whereas branded loss prevents uh, negating the activation. And Crow will just banish the target and make the card resolve without effect, not interfering the activation at all. Um, but yeah, that's it for the hand trap lineup in the deck, and that completes the uh, main deck lineup. And how many cards? How many cards? Um, in total, it's uh, 41. 41, okay, yeah. okay, okay. So for the extra, we play one recital. Because uh, it's at one. At one. Yeah. <laughs> they uh, hit your deck. <laughs> after, after doing a lot of testing with this, I would actually be only playing one, even if it was at more than one. Oh, okay. Uh, just because this card is insane. What is this? Um, shuffle back spells and traps. Oh, promenade, okay. Promenade, yeah. Um, I've shuffled in rivalry. So the Leerlesque engine thoroughly plays around rivalry. Sword Soul siding a lot into rivalry right now. Um, a lot of floodgate decks like Eldritch, but rivalry um, goes and match all those. And Leerlesque plays around them. And this can shuffle back the floodgate um, so I can touch in, uh, into Oh, my so tribe. you can just go. <laughs> yeah. And then I can make Zeus. Or I can just yeah, make, you can make Zeus after that. Yep. Yeah. Um, and then after that, I do uh, the Drake of Future package still. Um, Turn one, it's usually this, this, and then these two. It gets me into um, a negate before Nib is online. Gotcha. Or while Nib is online. What? I have Nerval on board, and then I have, I'm going into Draco Future, and if they want to Nib there, then I get the search off of Nerval, and I haven't even normal summoned yet, so I just normal summon the try name that I searched. Whoa. Just keep going. <laughs> and I just keep going. So I don't play around nib, I play into nib more Got so. Because it. it doesn't really matter if I get nibbed. Okay, look at this. This man said my deck does not care. <laughs> uh, this one too, an all-star of the deck. Um, it floats. It bounces not once per turn, um, and it's just a house, honestly. I've gotten up to six bounces on this, not once per turn. Ooh. My opponent just goes summon, summon, bounce, bounce. It's just, it's perfect. Man. And then finally, the OTK card yep. and yeah. Zeus for stacking on top. Yes. Yeah. Because this deck is Turbo Zeus. Turbo Zeus, yeah. <laughs> um, funny enough, no downer, though. Um, just because there's not enough room for downered. It's and tight in there. It's tight it in is. There. That's what she said. <laughs> And adding, uh, putting extra materials onto a bird has not really ever been a problem. Mm -hmm. I, so there are times where I wish down could come up, but the rest of the extra deck is just like so um, necessary that I don't play it. Gotcha. Um, then Almirage, cause fuck this card, it's necessary, I hate it. <laughs> Nerval, bro, we gotta send Nerval. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the, the only reason you need to run this card is because of Kit. If you were running like just Nerval, Link Rebo is infinitely better, cause you can use a Link Rebo in Grave to dodge targeting effects. Um, mm. Sometimes this comes up against uh, Branded though, because you link off and then you protect cards from the Chimera Pop and it works really well. Oh, cool. you're right. Yeah. Nerval comes in clutch for that reason, but I, I personally think it's it's net. You need some sort of link one in this deck gotcha. to get bodies up more. True, and yeah, that's pretty true. Uh, two double Dragon Lords. This card's insane. That card is actually insane. So it sends for cost one card from Hand or Field, and if you oftentimes send itself, your opponent has a droplet that they're like waiting to use to like make their combo go. You're like, nah. nah. And also, um, summoning this, if you suspect your opponent's on a trap deck, you summon this turn one. Why do you hate my deck, bro? <laughs> bro because uh, glue, that's all. It's just, it's just so much glue, bro. He's out of line. But he's right. Uh, you're under skill drain. You can send this card um, as cost and then bounce the skill drain. Mm -hmm. um, and it works really well. Yep. Um, Fergie, uh, Bear Brum, yep, standard. Rugal, and Shurig. Not two ofs of any Tri Brigade extra deck monsters, which is really rough. Yeah, you'll oftentimes see Fergie or Shurig at two but not enough room for me to put that in this list because this is necessary in corner cases, this is too. Um, this is just an amazing card and you need this for your normal summon. Right, okay, and then you're cool with not running multiples? You're cool yeah, with just no. once? I've, I've come to learn how to manage resources in such, such an efficient way that it doesn't really ever hurt me too much that I don't have enough gas because if I go into one line or if I go into the other, I'll always have the other like at my disposal for when I draw into it. And this Shurig, it bridges into the bird um, engine Oh, yeah, um, it does. It'll get you back resources. It'll get me a uh, bird from deck just to special summon back. So basically, it's just so interchangeable between the two that they just flow back and forth. Okay. And then for the big boss monsters, access code for game. And then uh, Appaloosa, because 
Um, in a double hand trap format, it sort of feels good to be running some sort of monster negate. That's uh, that's like multiple times per turn. All right, bro. Let's see this spicy side that that constantly keeps you winning at locals, bro. First play is my boy. Right, leading on the back row hate because fuck back row. Uh, one duster. Jesus. Double cosmic. Double twin. Um, you could run three cosmic for um, scythe lock because scythe lock is still somewhat relevant mm -hmm. in the meta and just fall, fallen out a little bit. But they're already siding Lancia against me um, because it's tri Lusk. And if they scythe lock me and then I go cosmic, I just neg myself because they chain Lancia. Um, and so I figured I should still be hating on back row a little more. And so double twin is really hidden, like putting yeah, in work for that reason. That's true. And um, that is true. You are a bird player. They are going to sigh Lancia and Cosmic will be dead. Yes, exactly. <laughs> um, and then, uh, yeah, and then two of just because of room reasons. And then triple Featherstorm. Oof, because the skill drain. This calling gonna... skill drain. <laughs> Lame, you have your own skill drain. Ban this card. <laughs> Ban this card. <laughs> And then of course reboot, uh, yes. because reboot's just a godsend. Yeah, this is what you destroyed me. Clap me with this. Yep. At the end of the round, finally, yep. bam. <laughs> drawing, drawing the one of is just you just gotta be good to draw the one of. You know? um, all right, triple Lancia. Yep. Um, because there's decks that banish. Hits Flandry's too good. Um, oh, Flandry. Yep. PK. Um, some people are still on PK. Always, always hype the PK train. <laughs> Lancia's just a great card. Uh, and then triple Droll with the one mismatching rarity, of course. Yes. Um, and yeah, because Droll kills Flandries if they don't draw Shifter. Um, and, um, what else is a kill? Fucking, so other, a lot of, Drytron, Drytron, if some people are on Drytron, because some people are coming back onto that deck. I guess. Bam, that's the, uh, full deck profile. All um, right, bam. Anthony, again, congratulations on the game. First place today at Locals, Thank winning you. the map, but also just... Bro, just being a great person <laughs> and just being undefeated at the rest of the locals, I just had an opportunity today to do your deck profile. All right, thanks, Brian. I really appreciate you. Shout out to Screw the Rules of Yu-Gi-Oh, bro. Bro! <laughs> Anthony, do you have any shout outs before we go? Um, yeah, shout out to Chris for keep let, always letting me use his droplets, uh, Joe for um, testing with me a lot and um, just being a homie, and then mm -hmm. uh, shout out to Sam for for running the best of you. We got Brian here today who is also a god. Bro, I know what Sam would say. He'd say this. All right, baby, I'm gonna show you two easy tricks for topping events. Number one, Astrograph Sorcerer. Number two, Electromite. Pen best deck, baby. Let's go! Let's go. <laughs> And uh, shout out to my girlfriend because uh, yesterday she graduated and then she pulled me a Fusion Destiny. I let her open an alternate pack and then she's just like, is this a good card? Again, Anthony, congratulations. Bro, game first place with Kaka. Kaka. It is <laughs> and the deck. we're going to keep seeing your successful achievements as we keep going in the future, bro. Again, right. congratulations. And it's been Screw the Rules of Yu-Gi-Oh, bro. We're out. Peace. Search. Wanna talk about numbers? With your manager buying swipe, show so bummy, ain't nobody out now that can touch.